By allowing motors to operate at less than full speed, VFDs can save 30% or more in energy costs. But VFDs can also damage motor bearings. Without shaft grounding, VFD-induced voltages can discharge through motor bearings causing damage such as pitting, frosting, and fluting. And unplanned motor failure in as little as three months. Revolutionary new Aegis bearing protection rings provide proven long-term protection against VFD-induced bearing damage. By channeling harmful shaft currents away from bearings and safely to ground, Aegis rings ensure that motors last for the L10 life of their bearings. Right now I'm going to show you some, some bearing faults to give you a good idea. This is a SKF, it is an angular contact, and if you get a good look at it, you can see these vertical lines from shaft current. This particular motor wasn't being run on a VFD, it was straight across line, it was inherent to the design of the motor. We re-insulated the bearing mount, installed the shaft grounding brush assembly into the lower bearing cap, and took care of the problem. This is a spherical roller that you can see has the same problem. It has vertical lines from shaft currents running all the way around the outside of the bearing. If you were using a bearing analyzer you would see a floor trash level way out in the middle of the spectrum if you're somewhere around 1500 hertz. You can see all the shaft current problems showing up. Some of the methods for being able to repair a problem when you have a shaft current issue is you can install an inexpensive method which utilizes a silver graphite brush material that's real low resistivity and very high conductivity and it actually runs at the bottom of the seal area of a bearing cap or of a housing and touches the shaft. Now these are good for average motors even up to maybe five, six hundred horsepower but if the current gets too great, one, it can actually try to melt the pigtail. It'll still make contact with the brush in the housing of the <coughs> brush holder itself. So this is one way that's a pretty good way to do it. It's not bad but there's a much better way to do it and that's by utilizing a shaft grounding brush by Aegis. This particular one is for a 20 megawatt generator unit. So you can see it's got carbon fiber that's all the way around that makes contact with the shaft surface. These are good for approximate 100,000 hours of use. So they've got a long longevity and they work very well. Uh, they could be made out of stainless steel or aluminum like this one in this case. Uh, several other constructions depending on if you have problems with chemicals or an atmosphere area problem. The Aegis brush design can be utilized inside of a motor. If we're going to use this process in a vertical motor, this is the one I would recommend where you're actually insulating the actual bearing carrier for the thrust bearings here and then installing the Aegis grounding brush assembly inside the bottom of the bearing cap at the bottom of the motor shunting any current or voltage past the bearing before it gets to the lower bearing by insulating that and having it flow through down to the framework that way. This works real well and eliminates about 90 percent of the currents. Aegis shaft grounding rings provide long-term bearing protection against damaging shaft voltage discharges. Proven in over a million installations worldwide, the Aegis rings provide the most reliable long-term bearing protection available today, dramatically extending the motor's life. Let's take a look at how the Aegis bearing protection ring works. The patented conductive microfibers in the Aegis rings have lower resistance than the motor bearings. They provide a path of least resistance to ground through the ring to the motor frame 
bypassing the bearings altogether. The specially designed patented microfibers of the Aegis ring flex without breaking and they operate with ultra low friction. Aegis's patented fiber lock channel secures microfibers in place. It also allows for microfibers to flex without breaking and protects microfibers from excessive dirt, oil, and other contaminants. And the patented Aegis Nano Gap technology ensures electrical contact whether the microfibers are in physical contact with the motor shaft or merely in nano gap proximity to it. Through the three distinct nano gap processes shown here, Aegis rings provide electrical contact with the motor shaft across gaps ranging from less than two nanometers to gaps greater than five micrometers. And these nano gap processes work simultaneously, providing unmatched bearing protection even in the presence of dirt, dust, oil, and other contaminants. Now let's compare the Aegis ring to other shaft grounding technologies, where single point or discrete point grounding brushes provide only about 4% coverage of the circumference of the motor shaft, Aegis rings provide 100% coverage. This is because the conductive microfibers of the Aegis ring completely surround the motor shaft, providing full 360 degree contact with the shaft. Discrete point designs only offer limited shaft contact. Because of their limited shaft contact, competitive technologies have much lower current carrying capacities than the Aegis rings. And while other shaft grounding technologies work only when they are in friction contact with the motor shaft, Aegis rings work both when in physical contact with the motor shaft and when merely in nano gap proximity to it. Consequently, they are effective even in the presence of dirt, grease, oil, or other contaminants. And finally, while other technologies are not suitable for use with VFD-induced shaft currents, Aegis rings are designed to provide superior bearing protection for such VFD currents. So why settle for the limited temporary bearing protection of competitive products and technologies? Insist on the proven long-term protection of the Aegis shaft grounding rings. And due to their superior design and performance, Aegis rings have been recognized with a host of awards over the years.